But really, what was it that triggered in your mind, in your heart? What is it? What is it that's different about you? I mean, let me, let me preface this question and frame it a little bit more before you answer. You know, there's a lot of people that get education for real estate investing. All right. There's a lot of people that will take education and not do anything with it. There's a lot of people that will. There's some like you that put it on steroids. What is it about you that's different that you would attribute to your success of putting this real estate investing education to work? There's a couple things. My why in an instant change. Tony Robbins talks about it's not what you want. It's what you can't live without. And so it was knowing that I can't live without my wife. I cannot live without my kids. I can't live without a safe place to, to protect our heads. And so my why shifted instantly. We were going broke. We didn't really have the money to keep doing what we were doing. And we weren't living an uh, exuberant life. We weren't living anything fancy. We we don't have cable. We still don't have cable. It's, uh, it's just one of those things that uh, what is your why? My why, I know everyone says it's just their family. But we, 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 we sometimes won't get uncomfortable. Hey, I can't get into real estate because I've got to do this, 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 but yet they have a $2,000 TV sitting on their wall. And it's like, how bad do you want it? Do you want Netflix more than you want financial freedom? And my why was just so crystal clear. I just wanted to be free. I didn't need to be rich. That's let's, let's get that straight. And I, I don't, it's not the money. It was I wasn't passionate about a policy. So here's my second point. I wasn't passionate about selling a policy. And that was probably the biggest problem. Insurance agents can make great money if you love what you do. And I would tell everyone on this podcast, love what you do and be passionate about it. The money will follow. This allowed me to really get inside my element, my zone, and just serve people. It has nothing to do with real estate. I think wholesaling is so um, misconceived as we're buying a home, we're buying a home really what we're doing is we're helping sellers solve problems. People come to us in the 11th hour and they're saying, Hey, on Friday, my home goes to an auction. Well, a real estate agent at that point can't help this individual, but Cody Hoffine can. And we go in there with the open heart, open mind to serve this individual. And the byproduct is you can get a contract that allows you to purchase the home. And that's truly how I built my business. And now it's not, it's never chasing the money. It's not chasing the paycheck. It's how do I serve the individuals of the state of Utah and truly bless them and add value to their life, irregardless if I get the business or not, still add value to them. And I have found out when I do that, the byproduct is I get contracts. And second of all, the Lord continues to bless my path. Yeah. So I think you just answered my next question partly. 